Hi, and welcome to the iSlips for QuickBooks demo. As you can see, when iSlips starts up, it starts on the time entry screen. You also have the ability to enter an expense and mileage if your version of QuickBooks supports mileage. Let's go ahead and establish a time entry. And iSlips can automatically establish a name for you if that's what you want. And we're going to go ahead and pick the person that we're going to do the work for the service item. Now what you'll notice is when you've selected the service item the notes and the rate are automatically filled in for you. Now one of the features of iSlips is the concept of abbreviations that you can establish here in the app. Now I've already established one of meeting with client and so if we simply put in the shortcut that we've established and hit the space bar, you can see it automatically spanned, expands out the text for you. Now we can enter in time spent on this particular time entry in multiple different ways. One of the ways is to turn on the timer. So we can just flip the switch and the time starts ticking away. Now we can go out of the program and it will still keep ticking that time. Another aspect is that you can turn this time on and off right here in the list. Now we can also enter in the time manually by using one of these fast buttons or a spin control or if you want you can enter in the start and stop time of when you had done the work and it will calculate out the exact time for you. As you can see, it also factors in what is your value of this time entry. Now we can also do expenses. It's very similar, where it's the account, the vendor, the customer job, memo, and so on. And in the case of the mileage, we can go ahead and establish the vehicle and you can see here it will automatically fill in the odometer start and end and what we can do is we can put in how many miles or another way of doing it would be to use the mileage calculator now the mileage calculator you can put in the start location the end location and it will calculate for you the number of miles that it took to go from one location to the other um, and if you want you can include a round trip. Now you can choose uh, as your starting point your office or your uh, customers office location or the current location of where you are. Okay so we'll just leave it at the 55 and we can go ahead and save that. You can see it's it's entered in its time. Some of the other features of iSlips for QuickBooks is the ability to automatically turn on a time entry. And so what we can do is we can dial the person uh, that we want to talk to and it will take and start a time entry for us. We can also track time when we are doing an email for a customer we can also see how many hours that we've spent for the particular customer and what the charges are for that customer. And that concludes the demo of iSlips for QuickBooks.